Hello, my name is Swiss Bianco. In this video I will talk about the Wenger Heritage Swiss Army Knife as we have it in front of the camera. First it comes with this white cardboard around the, the box. We see there already the stamp and the serial number. This one has the number 0205 and the maximum number was made 1893 so that much about that the box is a bit bit uh, more complex than the the Victorinox box so basically we have a lid that we're gonna take off and then we have the box here that folds open and then we can take out that part here it's it's a rather unique boxing system and then we have we have here the, the Wenger logo and slide to open I'm gonna do that basically it slides open like this paper and there we have it there we have it first we look on the paper it's rolled up actually that's the first time I open up this uh, knife I never did, did do that before so we have here the rolled certificate first in French then in English you can always stop the, the video and read it closer. And then at the end we have also the technical drawing of the knife. The back side is not printed. Then we have two of the silica gel and we have this part here oh, it's basically just the manual that you can use the display box for screw it at the wall I wonder how, how many did they uh, do that screw that on the wall if you do that then uh, let me know post a, a picture of it on my Swiss Bianco Facebook thanks and there is how to use that unique bottle uh, the unique uh, can opener the old style we're gonna see that in a minute the parts of it Backside is about the lifetime warranty. There is the signature of Mr. Hook. A couple days ago, I was sorry to hear that he leave Wenger. Since they do it stop manufacturing Swiss Army knives pretty much we will see how that goes uh, at the end of this year 2013 he decided to leave Wenger as we see this knife has micarta scales they are patterned towards the original wartime Swiss Army knife variation that they they had it's not 100% the same but it comes pretty pretty close and we see on the bolsters is the laser engraving on the tang of course the Wenger Delamo logo and the crossbow it's not an umbrella it's a crossbow if you don't know why Swiss and why crossbow then google up William Tell 
then you get it. The back side on the tang say Switzerland stainless steel. Again this knife is made in stainless steel as the Victorinox heritage. The originals were carbon steel. The rest is pretty much the same. We have the brass spacer. For the tools For the tools we have the first layer with the screwdriver, flat screwdriver. This was used mainly for the firearms in the Swiss military. That's one of the, the most tools that I used during my time in the Swiss military for clean take off, take this, uh, disassemble the, the assault rifle back then. Then we have the opener for the cans, the old style opener, that back then the cans were different than we have it now, so they had a different style of the opener. That was the one of the reasons why they changed to fiber material instead of the wood, the fiber was way more durable, kind of like uh, my carta we would say in today's world, those corners in wood that would easy damaged with my carta or fiber back then that was easier protected. Then on the second layer we have the big awl. Yeah, the main, main side is rounded, the other parts are a bit sharp. And of course, the main blade. Yeah, it's uh, the same problem as with the uh, Victorinox one. The spring tension is really on the on the weak side compared to the original. That was quite likely designed that way for the collectors. If you ever have the chance to try out the original knife of this this style, a wartime Swiss Army knife with uh, with the fiber with the fiber uh, handle then uh, do that and you you see be careful with your with your fingernails it's gonna gonna be tough to open even the, the main blade because you have more leverage from the privet point to the to the nail nick uh, that that is easier but uh, you need to be careful because the sharp edge by the smaller parts like the screwdriver that is closer to the privet so therefore is more more uh, strength on the on the spring so that that is a uh, tough that is tough yeah but all in all a uh, nice knife i like it the the box uh, since we can screw it on the wall that gives it a unique feature that's that's for sure uh, nice as well and uh, yeah that much about the wenger heritage swiss army knife